Partnerships are a type of business entity that predated the corporation. And in fact, predated it so much so that we have some of the earliest discovered writings from the ancient Babylonians 4,000 years ago or memorializations of partnership agreements between farmers who are sharing risk in a partnership. So I want to read you one partnership agreement from 568 BC. This is a contract for a partnership in the 36th year of Nebuchadnezzar II. So this is two investors investing money into a joint partnership and making sure that they memorialize the obligations and the investments of these two partners. Two manas of money belonging to Nabu Edin, son of Shula, and one half mana seven shekels of money belonging to Bel Shanu, son of Sen Emuk, they have put into a co partnership with one another. Whatever remains to Bel Shanu in town or country, over and above this investment, becomes their common property. Whatever Bel Shanu spends for expenses in excess of four shekels of money shall be considered extravagant. This contract witnessed, and then the names of the three men in a scribe are written, dated at Babylon, first of Ab, in the 36th year of Nebuchadnezzar. There's something comforting to me about the idea that we have individuals sharing risk and writing up a partnership agreement uh, between each other in the earliest memorializations of human writing in, in, in as far back as we can see into human civilization. That, to me, is why corporate law is interesting. Corporate law stretches back to the earliest recorded time of human civilization as human beings come together, share risk, and try to develop an investment that they can use to provide for their families. To me, that's what makes corporate law cool. Thank you.